Hi everybody, this is Avril Kefren, your favorite French Canadian. Today I'm going to show you how to improve your performance on the new Titanfall 2 game. First of all, you need to find the video config file. Uh, this file is normally in your user's uh, document, respawn, Titanfall 2, local, and after that, video config. Double click on it. And now you can see all the parameter that you can change in the game. So first of all, you can enable some parameter. You can change uh, like the resolution of it, if you can say, or the number of uh, like um, they have some kind of number to scale uh, the depth or stuff like that. And um, doo -doo -doo. yeah, that's about it. Um, very important in this game, all the shadows. If you don't, you want to lower your graphic setting and you don't want to lose too much uh, of the visual quality. Just go with lower all the um, shadow stuff. So uh, you have a way that you can uh, disable shadow just by here. And you can also change the depth of the shadow. Okay. Same thing with the shadow max dynamic. But uh, you have a nice uh, option that you can change inside of the game. So you should use that. Also, a nice thing to know, uh, you can see the V-Sync mode here. I didn't see it in the settings. So uh, that's a good thing that you can change in the video config. Second, um, when you do your testing, use advanced launch option. And uh, I'm using three parameter right now. First of all, the no vid, not important. It's just to skip the video of when you start the game. I is just to set the game high priority on your computer. So you make sure that all the resources are, uh, are uh, focusing on the game. And this one is very important, uh, show FPS when you're playing. So when you do a modification, you can see the, the FPS uh, uh, of your game. So I don't know, you remove your shadow, you were at 38 FPS, now you're at like 46, you know it's working and it's good, okay? So let's start the game quickly. So now we're in the game, uh, just go setting videos. First of all, I need to say uh, V-Sync, you can disable it. I didn't see the option uh, when I was playing, but this is just there. So uh, you, you can do it in the config file, but you also can do it in the um, game setting file. So as you can see, you have your FPS here, the top right. So let's start. Uh, resolution, for sure you can lower it, but Last, it's the last resort thing because uh, you will downgrade your visual quality a lot if you lower your resolution. The important thing is it's the sun shadow detail, spot shadow detail, and dynamic spot shadow. You can disable everything, boom, 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 and uh, you can get 10 to 15 FPS depending on your video card. For each bracket, I'm getting 2 FPS, so uh, that's a lot. That's a lot. Honestly, just do that. Test your game if you don't get your 60 go back and we will change other stuff um texturing texture filtering texture quality you can like keep it at something like high or very high uh it's not a big impact on your computer but um the texture filtering this one is a pretty big deal if you have a bad gpu uh lower this okay um i like 8x honestly it's really good you can go to four when you go to trillion now it's a little bit different you will see like some weird, um, how can I say that? Like, um, uh, it's not sharp the way you will see the game. Uh, so, uh, just do four. If you have like an integrate, um, not an integrate, but like a low end video card, just do uh, four. And uh, if you have like a mid range video card, just do eight and you will be uh, good with that. It's not the, like the graphic will look uh, good. Um, for model details, effect detail model, you don't get a lot of BF, so don't touch it. Uh, impact marks and effect detail, I saw a big improvement over there, not normal. Maybe they will uh, do some patching to optimize and more the game. But uh, yeah, effect you can get 2 to 3 FPS for each bracket, and impact mark 2 to 3 FPS too, so that's a lot. Okay, so that's about it, guys. Just look at those options. Uh, you don't have a lot of options in this game. Uh, if you compare that to Battlefield 1 or Armor 3, for example. But uh, still, you can uh, do some tweaking to, to get your 60 FPS easily. So if you have any questions, just comment in the YouTube section and post me your rig, uh, GPU, CPU, RAM, and I will try to help you the best that I can. Thank you very much, guys. Bye-bye.